Hello YouTube and welcome to a special video by the Unlucky Lads. As a thank you for reaching 200 plus subscribers, we wanted to release something to remember. So hopefully you all enjoy this milestone video, which we're really excited to share with you. Over the next few minutes, we'll be showing you an extremely fast XP level up method that the Unlucky Lads have been using to quickly get to level 99 so we could earn the Titanium Weapon Paint, Title and all other equipment, skill points and weapon blueprints. Hopefully you'll find this video useful, and as always, thank you for your support via comments, likes and subscribes. It's thanks to everyone that we're able to bring you content like this to enjoy. First up, this method is extremely fast for levelling up, but as with most good things in life, it comes at a cost, because there is an initial setup required, although once in place you can use this method again and again whenever you like. To start, you'll need at least one other player with you, and one of you will become the host who needs to have a character that has finished all but the final mission in Motherland. To do this, we strongly recommend that you start a new Motherland playthrough using a new character if possible, because it's paramount that the hosting character hasn't and doesn't complete the final mission in their current playthrough. This includes in their world or someone else's. At this point, it's also worth mentioning that the hosting character will be logging out a little later on, and therefore will not gain the XP from using our fast level up method, which is another reason to use a new character, because the host can always join back with a different character. However, if the host doesn't want or have a different character, then they'll need to find a friend that's willing to help them out at a later stage, but there will be more on that later on. As a side note, when starting Motherlands again, you can play through it with other players on easy difficulty, which can speed things up, especially if each player takes on a different section, skipping the hostage rescue missions as they're the most time consuming. Just make sure you join back to the hosting character's world if you do this over a few different sessions. We managed to get the hosting player to the final mission in about two and a half hours, but bear in mind if you're a new character, then you won't have access to the fast travel bivouacs or good guns, so you may want to collect a couple of good weapon blueprints and a few scale credits to craft the guns. Once the hosting character is at the final mission, which is the mission after destroying the behemoth at the top of Lava Shield on Golem Island and letting the audio exchange play out, you want them to let the game autosave with the final mission pinned. You're now ready to fast level up, and barring any mistakes, you can use this checkpoint continuously day after day, remembering that the hosting character will be logging out and not getting any fast XP. This is because any character who completes the final mission will not be able to host this method unless they reset their motherland progress and get up to the final mission again. So to get the XP from fast levelling, the host must now make sure their one to three friends are in the game with the final mission pinned. The host character must then log out, allowing if you want a fourth player to join or the original host can come back but they must make sure they're using a different character. Next, someone in the team must kill the final boss and collect the intel from her body. All players now wait for the final audio scene to play out and as soon as it finishes, the 100,000 XP will appear on the screen for everyone in the game. Now the team can rejoin the host character's lobby, pin the final mission, then allow the host to log out, then one player kills the final boss and collects the intel, lets the audio scene play out again, giving the whole team 100,000 XP for a second time. You can continue like this again and again, getting 100,000 XP for everyone in the game as many times as you want. Just make sure the host character is out of the game before completing the final mission, as they are the gateway to replaying this mission continuously. If for some reason the host character needs to level up too, for example it's their main character or they want all of their characters maxed out, then you'll need to find another player who becomes the host character and is at the final mission in Motherlands, having not completed it on that playthrough. Unfortunately, more often than not, this means that the new hosting character would need to start a Motherlands playthrough again. But maybe one of the group who's already reached 99 using this method would be able to restart Motherlands to return the favour. Please note that this would mean the previous hosting player would now complete the final Motherland mission, and would no longer be able to host the XP level up mission themselves, unless of course they restart Motherlands. So only switch host when you are sure you're ready to do so. 
As you can see in the video, we were XP level 2 before completing the mission for the first time, and then straight after it we were XP level 16. This is a gain of 14 levels in just one mission, and completing it a few more times took us up to level 35, so it's an extremely quick level up method. That's really all there is to it, but for some additional important details and a summary, please stick around while we reiterate the method. The host character cannot or has not completed the final mission during their current Motherland's playthrough. This includes in their own world or anyone else's. When hosting the fast level up method, the host character must log out before the final mission is completed and will therefore not get the XP reward. The host can, however, rejoin the game using a different character to the one that hosted the game. If the hosting character fails to log out in time or completes the final mission in any way, then this will mean the character can no longer host the fast level up method and the mission will be completed for them. If the host player completes the final mission, there is no way to re-host this fast level up method without having to restart Motherlands and following the steps mentioned earlier in this video. To get the host character to level up, we'll require another host character that is at the final mission in Motherlands having not completed it during that playthrough. This includes in their world or anyone else's. The mission must be pinned by all players in the game in order to receive the XP. The final mission requires the capture or kill of the boss. For the sake of speed, we've chosen the kill option. The XP will appear after the audio scene plays out once you collect the intel from the dead boss. Players can leave as soon as the 100,000 XP appears. You do not need to wait for the level up or skill points screen. The hosting character can invite players into the game when it's loading. This will save valuable time. Likewise, the hosting player can leave as soon as others are beginning to connect in. Players can begin to complete the mission before everyone has joined. Just make sure the hosting character has logged out and that everyone that wants the XP is in the game with the mission pinned before the audio scene has finished. Using Russian rations or other XP modifiers, such as clothing, guns or preparation, has no effect on the 100,000 XP gained. If you find players are spawning by the Eastern Bivouac, then the host character should stand in the room at the bottom of Lava Shield and then log out and close the game fully to the home screen, desktop or dashboard, etc. Next, the host reboots the game and selects their host character. Once the game reloads, they should be just outside the room by Lava Shield and now all future invites will cause the joining players to spawn by the hosting character, which saves a lot of time in the long run. As players level up, they will notice the XP required to the next level rises too. To start with, players should get averagely three levels or more gained for each time they complete the mission. But for example, once you reach level 98, to get to level 99, the XP required is around 800,000, or in other words, eight sessions of this XP leveling up method. As you can see from our timer, while using this method, it is possible to complete a full title screen to title screen 100,000 XP gain in under four minutes without much practice. This includes the host logging out with their host character and rejoining with a different one. This means each player can earn over 1.5 million XP per hour using this method. Plus, if the host character isn't rejoining using a different character, then they can be loading back up their own world ready to invite the rest of the team as soon as they gain the 100,000 XP that's granted in the other game. Using this slightly quicker method, when the host doesn't rejoin using a different character, we were able to achieve about 2 minutes 30 seconds from the main menu to the XP being granted. Theoretically meaning each player, excluding the host, can make over 2 million XP per hour. These timings were all done using an old Xbox One, so using a next-gen console or PC, I'm sure the timings could be improved even more. Don't forget that using the fast XP level up method will give you quicker access to the titanium weapon paint, a new title, new weapon blueprints and equipment, skill points used for weapon mastery, and also a new patch. To summarise this all in a nutshell, it requires the host character to be at the final mission of Motherlands, having not completed it on their current playthrough. Next, they invite their friends, who all pin the mission, 
The host character then leaves the session, allowing the rest of the team to kill the boss, then just rinse and repeat. That's all for now, but if you do have any questions or issues, please let us know in the comments. And if you've enjoyed this video, please consider a like and subscribe if you haven't already. But until next time, happy levelling up and thanks for the over 200 subscribers. Peace out, the unlucky lads.